hey everyone welcome back to my channel as you can see by the title i am going to be doing butterfly locks so i have done a lot of butterfly locks and i do have the link to the um other tutorials in my description box so i won't be saying much on this one i'll just i'll just be telling you the basics and what i use and how many packs and how long it took basically so we're using two colors we're using color 27 and we're also using color 613 i only use two packs of color 613 and i use four packs of color 27 so when i say packs it's aka bundles okay so um each pack or each bundle had about 30 counts of the spring tooth hair so in total i only used six packs aka six bundles and she wanted them spread out and we did the middle part we're doing like the bob or i would just say short because it's like shorter length the short um length basically and we did had about um i want to say 47 or 45 counts of locks in general and i will be doing the free parts for my clients as well so again as you can see i do have my wristband and i always talk about it because it saves a lot of time you don't have to keep going back to your edge control container you can just put a good amount of edge control in your wristband and then just keep touching it or keep dabbing it as you part your clients here and i also had the link to the um, rat tail comb in my description as well and also the edge control that i use for my clients i do have the link to all of them in my description box um yeah if you have any other questions feel free to ask me yeah if you have any question feel free to ask me but i've done a lot of the tutorial before so that is why this one is not as detailed as like, you know i would want them to be i usually you know i usually have them but I would say that for one locks, we used about three to four strands of the spring tooth hair for one lock. So I start wrapping with one and a half strand, and then I continue wrapping with two strands. And sometimes you would need just a little bit towards the end, and I would just take one piece, one strand of the spring tooth hair, divide it into two, and I use just a tiny piece just so that I have something to wrap up to make sure that the spring twist is already you know is tight and sealed but you're going to see what i do as we go into as we go um in this um video if you have any questions again feel free to ask me here. also i do have a link to some of my butterfly look tutorial that are more detailed and stuff like that just in case you need to see something asap before i reply you and yes um thank you for um clicking and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll be seeing you guys in my next video thank you
Thank you.